Keep calm, we're having a baby. I'm Hyla in Hollywood for the Daily Buzz on CelebBuzz.com. The Duchess of Cambridge, Kate Middleton, is expecting. On September 11th, during Will and Kate's trip to the Far East, Kate toasted with water, and that's when rumors started to fly. Now it's official with this statement from the palace to Celeb Buzz, quote, their Royal Highness, the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge, are pleased to announce that the Duchess of Cambridge is expecting a baby. The Queen, the Duke of Edinburgh, the Prince of Wales, the Duchess of Cornwall, and Prince Harry, and members of both families are delighted with the news. Wow, this is heavy duty stuff. Also, St. James Palace website, it crashed, of course, when this news was first released. Joining me right now from People Magazine is Raha Lewis and the host of The Duchess Diaries on sociallife.com, Kelly Lynch. Kelly. I know, you are super, this is why you live. This is like my second birthday. The this day is, is why here. I live, Hyla. Uh, first thoughts when you heard the news. I was, it was as if my sister had become pregnant and I was just so elated. My friend in DC actually texted me and I cursed the West Coast time because it was so early. But when I heard, I just kind of sat there and I just smiled. There was no jumping up and down. I was just so, there was like an inner peace. It was like I was pregnant. Uh. <laughs> Well, congratulations. Uh, Ra, we, there were some clues leading up to this. I mentioned her toasting water. Yes. What were some and, other clues? And Prince William accepting the onesie. I think yes. everyone saw that and said, oh my goodness, could this possibly be? And it finally is. And we are so happy for them. It really is. And I think to your point, with, with so much, you know, down, like economic downers, this and that, News like this, it really makes you feel happy, uplifting. It's just a perfect story, and it really does feel like it's your sister. Now, this is going to be the, the greatest. Yeah, this is going <laughs> to be the greatest baby since Simba, right? I mean, this perhaps is... or since William. I mean, both had the same effect. You hold them up to the light, and they just and they beam. just glow. Yeah. Exactly. What does this mean exactly for the monarchy? Is it a big deal if it's a boy or a girl? It doesn't matter. It's in just this another age, heir right? or heiress. Yeah, there, it doesn't yeah. affect who's in line. Charles is next in line to the throne, then William, and then this baby. Whether it's a girl or a boy, because primogeniture is done. They got gotcha. rid of it in 2011. Yes. There you go. That yeah. makes sense. Just in obviously. time. Yep. Just in time for sure. <laughs> Now, uh, apparently she's having some really bad morning sickness. What's that all about? Okay. Hyperemesis gravidum. gravidum. Yes. Okay. And it just basically means she's very nauseous and is vomiting a lot. So and she's like happen. every other woman who's pregnant? But it's worse. <laughs> it's worse. It's worse than just morning sickness. Like you're so ill that all the nutrients in your body are just flushed out. And um, in her case, she had to go to the hospital. So she's going to be there for a few days. They're going to monitor her. Okay. But um, I guess it happened. A royal reporter, Richard Palmer, at the, from the Daily Express in London, said that she was at her parents' house in Buckleberry when it happened. Mm -hmm. So they rushed her to King Edward the, sec the Seventh Hospital in central London. Okay, not to be confused with the Sixth, which is a exactly. really crappy hospital. You don't <laughs> want to go there. Yeah. Uh, and uh, she's just kind of keeping her routine. I know she's in the hospital now, but she was playing field hockey she was. earlier this week. Here she is, just killing it high heels. Yeah. Why not? Um, so she's, it seems like she's going to try and keep her routine as, as normal as possible yeah, between she's now gonna, and... But they've got a lot of um, upcoming events in December. They have well, a jam-packed schedule. she's canceled her next three, oh. um, unfortunately, just due to the morning. To the sickness, yeah. right, exactly. But she's being treated and it's going to be okay. Yeah. Prince William is by her side, you know, and she's very athletic and active, so I'm sure when it is treated and she's feeling better, she will be out and about. Well, ladies, I have a feeling we're going to have you back a lot over the course <laughs> of the next, I don't know, six odd months. Thank you so much for coming in. Let us know what you think. Use the hashtag The Daily Buzz. And for the biggest stories breaking right now, head on over to CelebBuzz.com. At least it's not...